Like okay, this. so I, I've got my brother here who um, is a physicist, and he's going to explain what he has here for. This is a Kaltman HF4040 RF spectrum analyzer, and this handheld is just being used to measure the intensity of microwaves outside a microwave oven that we have. Right now, it's displaying the instantaneous microwave levels. Down below to Salzburg 1, that's the old Salzburg precautionary level of 1 milliwatt per square meter. So right now we're not registering on that, on that level. I'm going to hit the, the, the um, this little period, and then it will start displaying the maximum. So watch when I push this, and now free, it looks like it froze at negative 75, and there went, went up to negative 74. It's just showing the maximum, holding the maximum. So it's like the peaks of the it's just, wave. It's the peak the, so far. The, not the, the whole wave. Well, right. it's, not, it's not the instantaneous over time. It's what, the maximum since I pressed that little dot. Yeah. Now, Go ahead and turn on the microwave. Okay, so we're going to turn and the microwave. One minute? Sure, yeah, say one, one minute. minute. And hit start. And then start waving it around so you hit all three axes. And that's the receiver there. And look at that. Look here, we're at the Salzburg. We're at 37%, 40% of the old Salzburg, 100% of the old Salzburg level. 340%, four times the old Salzburg level, of one milliwatt per square meter. How many times was it worse is it now than before? We're now at 500. We just hit. 600% of the... I don't want to be close to this thing. How long? All right, just go ahead, just so go ahead yeah, and turn it off. Yeah, you can turn please. it off. All right, good enough. All right. So we got, we got up as high as 1,000% of the old Salzburg level, 1 milliwatt per square meter. In other words, this was 1 watt per square meter. Of instant, radiation. Instantaneously. It wasn't continuous. It was instantaneously at some place where that antenna was located. How dangerous is that? Yeah, that's the key question. Um... Like first of all, what frequency is this? This is microwaves. Gigahertz. This is what, well, this is the frequency which uh, which um, it excites water vapor molecules. So it's the kind which can give you cataracts and can give you brain brain tumors. So there's a certain range that excites water molecules in and, your body. Yes. And do you know? Can you tell us what that range is? I do not remember. I would recommend looking it up rather than. Oh, okay. You know, this is around 2.45 gigahertz. So I thought she told me between two and three gigahertz it was dangerous because then the water molecules in it's your body. It's at least in there, but I don't remember exactly how far it right. goes. Somewhere then, around one megahertz it start, drops. Right. The frequency gets down to a level where it's not going to be resonant with your water molecules. And by the way, when we say hertz, we mean electromagnetic ra radiation. So you can go look that up, up on the electromagnetic spectrum on Google. Right. But the okay. danger to the body is that the water in your body is heating up. Right. Well, it's not just heating up, it's also denaturing your proteins, and so it can be giving you cancer, that kind of thing. It's not just resonant with water. Water is one thing it's resonant with, but also proteins as well. That's why it can give you cataracts. So, in other words, in other words it has a bad effect on your body, and the fact that it resonates at the water level, and your body's made mostly of water, is, should give you concern. Well, it's also the water is like the canary in the, in the mine. Because there are other things in your body which are also resonant at that frequency. Right, nucleic acid, the DNA. Right. So yeah. the next thing let's do, let's do this. I'm going to release it again, so we're back to instantaneous level. And the next thing I want to do is let's see what it's like when we keep the antenna far away from it. See how far, okay, that see sounds how far good. Away we have to go. So let's just start so, with further away. Okay, so I'll take the antenna way back here. Right, All right. And, and, and I'll wave turn it around. On, turn on the microwave again. I, I put it on max level again. One minute. Start. It says 15 seconds. Wait a minute. One minute. It's start. Okay. I'm All right. So I'm waving it around here. And what okay. do we have? We're at seven percent of the of the old Salzburg. Let's. What were we before? We were at a thousand percent. So just by moving from there to here, we dropped from by are a we, factor of a hundred less dangerous. And how far are we from here? Yes. From there to here. Wow. So it's a hundred times less dangerous if you take five steps back. Right, so Basically. that's why you should always stay away from the microwave, microwave oven. And 8% uh, of the sal old Salisbury limit, it was okay with me. I'd, some people might be a little concerned. It's, 